wake up. Louis slept in the arches all night. I can't believe you're completely naked under that cramp. <laughs> oh, shh, Ben. It's like everyone knows. <laughs> you two out early? Oh, yeah, Abby was, uh, just walking me to work. Oh. Well, work's that by, innit? Ooh. Thought we were doing the same, huh? I swear, bro, under that coat, totally naked. Yeah, I don't really want to hear it. What is all this, eh? Tea like that. Well, why are there 500 of them? Fucked in my bin, eh? Sharon, please. Please answer the phone, will you? She's not talking to you. What a surprise that is. She's gone round at Vincent's. She went first thing. I feel sick. Well, feeling sick's less awful without the headache. Take them. Oh. Why'd you get upset last night? Did I? Don't play the amnesia card, then. I was just really happy. Was it, um, anything to do with Grandad? She was over-emotional. First birthday you haven't missed in years. Nearly had me going, too. Oh, two burials and a cremation on a hangover. When will I learn? Abby and Ben forever. Pass me that enamel paper. Why? Because if Phil sees it, it goes mad. That's the way. So? <clears throat> Jay, what's up with you? Look, I, I don't want it spraying over. Why? Because you love Abby forever, or because you want your dad to see it? But who cares if he does? That's why you left them candles out, wasn't it? Mate, it is so desperate. She surprised me last night. And time. she's desperate too. Because that ain't Abby walking around the market naked. Jay, why do you care all of a sudden? Because five minutes after you say goodbye to her, you're going to be talking to fellas on that app of yours. Right. I can't help it if someone messages me. Why is it on your phone? Me and Abby, we were together for years. Right, and although we're finished now, I still care. I care. You care about keeping up appearances. I'm surprised you ain't made her give you a love bite that you can show off. What's this? Oh, yeah, uh, that's from my missus, because, you know, I am so straight. I'm such a geezer. Shut up, you mug. Right, well, you either delete the app, or I'm going to tell her. And then we'll see her wherever you are, eh? Let's go straight to voicemail. Nan's gone back to bed. She's really ill. Yeah, she always overdoes it on her birthday, that one. She still won't tell me why she's upset. We told you. You told me a lie. Does she know? About you and Claudette? I can't tell you why your nan's upset. It's not my place. You'll have to wait until she's ready. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm late opening up. So many secrets. How do you keep track of them all? When she does tell you, please try to be more sensitive than you are with me, Paul. <laughs> 